Oh, it's you. Yo, me and me. Mm. I just woke up. This recording right here is about trans empowerment. In June, Christmas lingerie for the transgendered woman is going to be having, sensitively, a fashion show flash mob on 42nd Street. It's pretty much a big deal. You know, I may come across a little bit as an extrovert through my little YouTube videos. But in reality, I am not. A little nervous. I'm a little nervous. We're going to be holding um, auditions, I guess, or a casting call kind of thing, open call, for for this um, sometime in June. That's all I know. And, you know, just trans empowerment in total, you know, I don't know. I just have so much respect for a lot of these girls who are doing their thing and, you know, have an image out there and I think that is like amazing I know Miss June is doing amazing things Milan is doing amazing things um you know Monique Fontaine I'll be looking at your pictures girl and Facebook and things really some artistic wonderful stuff and you know so I look up to these people so much it's so so interesting even my gay mother Denise <laughs> You know, I'm probably just as knowledgeable about the girls as a fucking tranny chaser or something. It's like I'm a fucking tranny chaser, but I'm not. Not a lesbian or anything like that. But I know the girls. I, like, watch them. I observe. I'm, like, always seeing who's, who's around. And, like, I just think... That's one really interesting that we can even, you know, that like, you're all like mini celebrities to me. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, I've been inspired by so many of you and um, motivated to even, you know, begin my own transition by so many people. Denise was, you know, definitely one of the ones to do that. But, you know, even looking at other people like Nomi Ruiz, like, idolized. Giselle Extravaganza idolized, you know what I mean, so many of the ballroom divas idolized, like, and so many people who I've just met in passing who have idolized, uh, um, Tyra Mugler, one of the, you know, only other tall, black, beautiful trans women that I admire so much. You know what I mean? I remember one time I was, like, at Splash or Escalito or Crash or something. And, you know, I was dressed up at that time. I was just in drag. And this guy goes, oh, with baby Tyra. You know what I mean? Like, I'm right in front of Tyra. And I'm there. And I'm like, you know, at that point, I didn't know whether to take that as a compliment or a shade. But, of course, I took it as a compliment because to even be compared to Miss Tyra Alua is, you know, awesome. But, you know, it's kind of shady because he was only doing it because, you know, we were, we were both tall and black, you know. But whatever. Live for her. I live for Deja. Bogan Deja. Eating it. All the girls. Every trans woman I have encountered has inspired me, has affected my life. Even the ones who I have not even met in person have an impact on, on my existence. And I think that we all impact each other's existence. And I think we need to recognize that and be more united and less divided. And, you know... Yeah, I don't know. This shit is 10 minutes long. I'm done. 
I'm going to see if anybody wants to watch this because I'm going to post it. But, you know, maybe I'll put this up in one of those groups and all the groups that we got going on on Facebook. It's like a million trans groups. And I, and that's another thing, too, with all these groups and all this empowerment and all of us that there are, you would think that we would be more unified. Like, God, we need a real, can we, like, get a real tranny party? Like, not one for coins. I mean, like, one just straight up celebrating us. Like, come on, people. Let's be more together. But June, even if you're not going to be in the show or whatever, everyone should come and support the Chrysalis lingerie thing. It's going to be a big deal. And if we show up in droves just on 42nd Street, even just to watch this happen, like, that is going to say a lot about, like, the times and the climate and the way things are right now. I mean, we got, you know... Glitter bombs, glitter bombing people and all kinds of stuff like that. Like, you know, let's do, let's have a positive uh, thing happen too. So, I don't know. Jasmine, say hi.